so guys welcome to watch chrissy work makeup page and this is a voiceover review what i will be doing is i will be reviewing the makeup work done by my wife as you can see right here she applies a vino uh moisturizer and the moisturizing is normally something you put on your face before to get it soft and remove the dryness and all of that so when you apply the makeup it is not you know on dry skin here you see she is going to be using a anchor pencil and um that anchor pencil is going to be used on the eyebrows this is where she you know do her art skill because she had um a in art in school so she knows how to draw a perfect eyebrow and um that's one of the key thing i realized about this makeup artist watch chrissy work she always have a perfect eyebrow on her face and this anchor pencil is one of her main ingredients in getting this job done as you can see she's now showing you the full face or full eyebrow so she has completed one what i will say is that's a perfect eyebrow i'm gonna give her an a on that this is one of her makeup brush from her very own makeup line which is watch chrissy work you can find these products on her website at www.watchchrissywork.com you'll find now guys as you can see she just present one of her main ingredients for her face beat she's applying concealer on her eyelids and um what i'm assuming from that is when she do use the brush that you're seeing right now to blend it out for it to look flush and um, in with the skin then you know she's going to be doing something maybe a cut crease maybe i don't know however we're gonna watch and see what she's doing so she is um, going to be using different eyeshadows because that was an eyeshadow palette and guys bear in mind watch chrissy work is working on her very own uh palette that will be launching very soon so she is getting inside of her crease with that color no i'm not a big fan of color so i did not pass the coloring test in school so i won't be able to tell you what color that is but if you get access to the palette you will see now guys pay keen attention what she's about to do is show you one of her techniques and um this is one of the best way guys you can also get um your your inside of your crease proper so you don't go over or don't go up enough if you get what i'm trying to say so she makes sure she make an indent and marking and line it's like using a ruler to draw a straight line now i told you she's precise with her um brushes and as a makeup artist a professional one you one would expect that of her so what she's doing now she's getting inside of the crease but not over it you know just where that um crease line breaks that eyelid breaks when you lift it up that's what she's doing and she's applying the concealer there watch and see the greatness now you see how precise that is guys it is as almost as if she was using a ruler you know but as you see it's a crissy technique that makes a <laughs> the cutting of the crease perfect and this is how you cut the perfect cut crease she's blending to get everything looking flush and perfect she's on to drawing the wing guys and um as i can tell you guys i know this for a fact she her, her, her art skill as i keep telling you is on point precision she's very precise and always draws a straight line and this is um she drawing a wing so as you can see it is um what it's supposed to be looking like now she's going to use one of the liners everyone asks her about whatever she's on the road yo that white liner where do you get it how do you do it i want my makeup like that and now you guys are witnessing how she applies it how she do it um this is a makeup that i will say you know what i like the way how she applies her makeup because um she spent times with it <laughs> she looking at herself and i wonder if it on point yeah yeah look good man look good now what you're seeing is where she's gonna apply the glitter she is doing this just so she can have the glitter on the face set. Kushian, come here. 
Come look for this there for me. Come now, man. All right, may I come? Be sure. <laughs> Anyways, yeah. Come now, man. Let me get for start my makeup. All right, thanks. Now, guys, as you can see, she's applying um, the glitter. I will give you a tip. Do not apply glitter on your face after applying makeup. It just doesn't make any sense because some of the glitter will fall off on your face and you don't want that makeup to be on your face. Now, as you can see, glittered up, glittered all about, glittered round. All right. Now, I am applying the foundation, which is, um, I would consider, one of the easiest thing to do but for most it is not because the key thing is blending and if you realize how i'm doing it is um i am putting it in my skin i am not swiping i am not wiping i am tapping it tap 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 because that way you want it to soak inside of your skin and not like a wipe thing so your skin will absorb it back to my foundation and i put some under my eyes to cover any dark spot any sleepy look you know because i'm a hard worker sometimes i get limited amount of sleep so what i do is i try to conceal that and um what you guys gonna see is what my husband would call um the arawak look he calls it the arrow look because I apply the concealer, the nose, under the eyes, the chin, and the forehead. But those are key spot because I am going to have to blend these guys. But you'll see the finished magician look. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You look good, man. I want to you. They can wear the makeup, so. Alright, the sponge. And guys, always have your sponge a little bit damp, you know, moist. So when you blend it is perfect and remember guys you do not wipe when you are blending you tap 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 that is a key thing to um having a proper blended makeup because you don't want to be looking like a scarecrow you don't want to be out there in this world with your makeup and it is wrong shade or it is not blend properly and as a makeup artist doing other clients face i have to make sure i am perfect so when someone look at my face they'll see perfect makeup and those are words of um watch chrissy work <laughs> on point now this is a laura mercier it is um a powder that used on makeup and um what i must say i realize watch chrissy work she's taking all the necessary steps um when applying makeup she doesn't um jump to one step without doing the other with this powder though guys it sets the makeup on your face remember um the makeup is moist and um you don't want to have any cracks you don't want to have any breaks in your makeup and you want your makeup to last for probably hours when you're on the road so guys this is a powder she applies on her face it defines her um, i would say her jawbone and um, i'm thinking that she's preparing it for her blush application like i said guys reviewing this makeup work done by watch Chrissy work i am impressed i'm pretty sure most of you guys will be too now this is where she applies the blush you know and um the reason for her to give you that smile is um to have the makeup set on the face while it is um what you call now ring i don't know when she smiles because you want to bring across that look same look when she smiles for the picture now i'm using um watch chrissy work rose water guys yes you can order that also on the website and this is also an highlighter and as she would normally say on her live videos time for blind yet as them now if you realize um she still uh, makes um her face up like she's smiling because she wants that very same look whenever she smiles you know it's like me getting an ear cut and the barber pull back my skin to you know make sure the ear is cut instead of trying to cut it while the crease is in it and um this is where she put highlights on some of the key parts of the face the you know the cheeks the nose you know all of that yeah on point all 
I realize um, she spends a lot of time on um, her eye and what I've learned about the makeup so far it is that most of the makeup work is done on the eye the eyeshadows the eyebrows all of that now you see where she's um, blending under the eye so it is you know flush mascara the thing One would want to think that the makeup work is done after looking at it like this um, she's using her very own eyelashes also and her very own lipstick watch kiss your work you can find all these products on her website www.crissyworkcom watch Chrissy work did I spell that correctly yeah now she's applying um, the lipstick on her lip. It is matte. It is, I think she chose, um, that's a perfect color. It matches what I'm seeing on the, um, the eyeshadow. You know, let me know what you guys think. Now, it is time for you guys to be the judge. Let me take this off my head real quick. Yes, take it off the man, you tell me about. Mm-hmm. What I must say to you guys is that um, after watching how she applies her makeup, there are a lot of technicalities, but it is simple and easy for her because she has been doing this for quite some time. Um, I like the look, the glittered look, and this is, I would call, a Christmas beat. And you never can always see a makeup done by her without the slow-mo effects. Yeah, girl, go on, do your thing. Your money love you. Your guy wrote them and ask you, who do your makeup? Your thing are shot. Talk to them, watch Chrissy work. Guys, remember to subscribe to the page, follow this page, share this, comment, leave your opinion. Also, tell a friend to tell a next friend that you just watch Chrissy work. Yeah.